Good morning. Today we're going to make some breakfast egg bowls using some Pillsbury Crescent dough, some eggs, some butter, and that's just the first part. The second part will be some smoky cream sauce and it's going to be delicious. So let's get this started. I'm going to make three bowls for you right now so you can see how to do this, but I'm using the Crescent Rolls. You can also use biscuits or whatever is the Pillsbury dough that you find in your refrigerator. <laughs> you can use uh, pizza dough, breadstick rolls, you can use any kind of dough. But right now I'm using crescent rolls because you, they're pretty flat. When you roll them out they're already flat. If you have biscuits you have to press them out and make them nice and flat. But what I want to do here is take some of the crescent rolls and just line the cups and I have a 7 ounce ramekin here. You could also use <clears throat> muffin pans. It can be flexible. We want to make sure the dough covers the bottom. Just press the seams together where you have pieces. And, a little, and you want to go up the sides because we're going to put a little egg in here. Well actually we're going to put a big egg in here. <laughs> I have jumbo size eggs that's why I need a large ramekin. If you have small eggs, you could probably use like a regular muffin pan. I have the toaster oven preheating to 350 degrees. Alright, want to look something like that. Alright, we're going to make all of them filled up. And just, they don't have to be beautiful, they just have to keep the egg from going back through the bottom of the cracks. They don't have to be beautiful, you just want the egg to stay inside the, the dough. You don't want to go into the bottom of the muffin pan or the ramekin. Something like this. A little crust at the edge is okay. Quick and easy. And this will be a nice base for the special sauce that we're going to make. All right. Now that you have the three ramekins filled, we'll use something. We'll make something else with the rest of that dough. I'm just going to take a tiny bit of butter, put it in the bottom here. It gets the sizzling started there in the toaster oven. Now I have some sausage crumbles that I'm going to use in the smoky cream sauce. I'm going to just put a few of those in the bottom of each one of these two. Now I'm going to crack the egg into one of each one of these. All right, and my oven is preheated. And my KitchenAid toaster oven is preheated, so we're going to put these in there 350 degrees for 20 minutes. In the meantime, we're going to make the smoky sauce. I'll show you how. We're going to mix everything together here, and we're just going to keep stirring it until it gets nice and creamy. tablespoons of Worcestershire, Worcestershire, two tablespoons. We need 
need about a teaspoon of paprika. And this is the smoked version. That's where you're going to get some of your smoky flavor here. Then we have red pepper flakes, a couple shakes of those. And if you're a person that likes to add salt and pepper to your food as you cook it, this is a good time to do it. I'm not going to add any extra salt to ours. Feel free. And then as you're warming this and stirring it and melting the cream cheese, add enough milk to make it a nice sauce that you can pour over top of those egg bowls. I'll let it sizzle and bubble a little bit. It smells good. Let's let it let's let it heat up. All right, got kind of nice and creamy. That's getting there. Beautiful. Now, if you want to be a little more liquid, just add a little more milk. That's what I'm going to do. And we're going to let this sit without cooking for uh, the rest of the time. That the and we're going to let this. Uh, as soon as I mix this in, I'm going to let turn the heat off here and let this just sit and stay warm. While we're waiting for the ramekins full of eggs. I'm going to turn the heat off now and let this pan just sit and stay warm on the burner here while we're letting the uh, egg bowls finish in the toaster oven. Look how nice. Oh boy, that's nice. While I'm waiting for the um, while I'm waiting for the eggs to finish, I just have to taste a little bit of this sauce. Mmm, that is really good and a little spicy, of course. Okay, we're gonna get them out of the oven. They're Looks like they're perfectly done. Look at that. Wow. Okay, so the eggs are still dippy eggs and the crust is nice and brown. So we're going to serve this on a plate and pour the cream sauce over top. Let's take this one. All right, we're going to serve this on a plate, and the cups are nice and full. Now, if you have made these in a muffin tin, you can take them out and serve them that way. But I'm going to leave them in the ramekin, and we're going to pour the sauce right over top and serve it that way. Can you see that in this? All right, we have the creamy sausage sauce here, and we're just going to pour it over top. And I don't mind telling you, this is a little spicy. 
All right, and if it drizzles down the side, that's fine. That's how we're going to serve it. Okay, if you like that recipe, please give it a try. It's smoky, delicious, and spicy for breakfast. All right, let's give it a taste. See how it is in here. We got the chunks of sausage. It's pretty hot. We got the nice dippy egg. Oh my gosh, look at that. How's that for a bite of breakfast? I have to let this cool off a second. <laughs> oh my God. All right, I'm going to taste it. Oh boy, that <clears throat> that is really good and it is really spicy. I think that's an awesome recipe. If you have a chance, give it a try. Thanks for watching my video and I hope you have a chance to make this recipe.